hey everyone welcome back so sometime during sharing of our computer screen with other at that moment we need to hide some sensitive data right it means if we don't want to share some sensitive or private data with others during sharing of our computer screen or during recording of the computer screen then how we can do that this is the today's agenda all right so now let's see how we can do that but before that let me show you this is the tax information network of the income tax department okay so here in this portal suppose we will apply for online pan application all right so in this portal i just want to share the screen with other or i suppose i just want to record the screen for my youtube video at that time how i can hide my sensitive data like suppose this is a heading lamp okay for this box right so suppose i don't want to share this here you can see the heading of this particular box is in blur form right likewise here you can see this is my surname this is my first name middle name and this is my email id my date of birth and mobile number right so all these are my sensitive data and i i just want to hide all this sensitive or the private data from the users or from the end user okay and you can observe whenever i am moving this particular piece at the time also this particular blower part is not removing it's stick to this particular values right so let's see how we can do this all right so for that first of all you have to go to the google chrome and here you have to search for zero blur okay and after that here you can see this is the first link right zero blur on google so just click over here and make it open and then it will take you to this particular page and here you can see this is the extension that is called as the zero blur extension right so to achieve our goal we have to add this particular chrome extension all right that is called as the zero blur and let me tell you this zero blur extension is completely free of cost okay so just click on this particular add to chrome button okay then click on this add extension and here you can see we have successfully added this particular zero player extension in our chrome okay so to get that first of all you have to click on this particular extension icon then in the below part you can see this is the zero player extension that we have added recently right then just click on this pin icon and pin this particular zero player extension on this particular bar okay so now go to any particular page okay suppose here this is a tax information network of income tax department all right and here we will apply for online pan application okay so let me first refresh this particular page all right and here i want to apply for online pan application okay so to do that first of all we have to put our detail like application type all right and category something like that and here it will select our or it will write our last name suppose my last name is patel okay and my first name is roshan all right and this is my middle name and in place of middle name i want to write as kumar all right and suppose this is my date of birth and this is my email id okay and this is my phone number okay now i want to hide this sensitive data suppose this is these are the sensitive data then i want to hide all this data from the end user during recording of my computer screen at that time what you have to do so for that first of all you have to click on this zero player extension that we have added recently then make it enable okay then click on this edit player icon and then you can see this type of tools over here by the help of which we can blur our personal or the sensitive data from this particular page okay so first one here you can see first one is the blur elements okay so whenever you will click on this particular thing and it will take your pointer to any particular options or the text right at that time here you can see a box over here right red type of box so it will take this pointer to this particular page and it will click over here then here you can see this particular things has been blurred right likewise suppose i want to do the blur arbitrary okay so at the time just click over here then you can see a plus type of icon then drag it on that particular text wherever you want to hide all right again if i want to hide this one you can blur this part as well likewise this is my mobile number and i want to blur this and this is my email id that part also i want to make it blur all right so in this way you can blur your personal or 
private data from this particular web page all right then this is the text by the help of which you can blur any particular thing as blur okay and this is the delete icon if you click on this delete icon then the entire blur thing wherever you have applied right on this particular piece that all will be deleted at a time and here you can see if suppose i want to delete this blur things right so if you will click over here this blur part only removed but if i will click on this particular delete icon then entire blur wherever you have done all these blur things that will be removed okay then this is the plus icon by the help of which you can increase the blur intensity suppose i will increase this so here you can see the blur part is increasing and if i will decrease it then here you can see the blur sensitivity is reduced right and the next thing is here you can see this is the global icon it means suppose i want to apply this blur to enter site it means on this particular site wherever i can get this roshan thing I want to make it blur so I can make it as a close so whenever I will write this particular name at that time automatically this part will become blur all right so in this way you can easily blur your private or the sensitive data whenever you want to share your screen with others or whenever you want to record your computer screen right but before that if you want to record your screen so first of all you have to close this so it will close this then you can see this blur part you will you can't see that uh, particular tools options over here so that you can smoothly record your computer screen and now if i'll scroll down or scroll up at that time also you can see this particular parts are in blur form it is not removing and it is completely stick to this particular text right so in this way easily you can blur your sensitive or the private data whenever you are going to share your screen with others all right so thanks for watching take care bye bye